A jury convicted Nasser Hamed of murder last week. Today, it started the sentencing phase. A number of people testified in court today. First News reporter Nadine Grimley has been covering this story since the beginning. Tonight, she's live outside of the Trumbull County Courthouse. Well, one of the witnesses that the defense team called to testify today was Dr. James Reardon. He's a psychologist that the defense counsel had wanted to call to testify during the first phase of the trial, but had not been permitted to do so. Now, when Dr. Reardon took the stand, he testified that he believes Nasser Hamid had PTSD or post-traumatic stress disorder with dissociative episode, saying it's his opinion that Hamid did not have full-blown PTSD symptoms up until the day of of the shooting and it's likely that the trigger was the fight that happened on his property just minutes before that shooting. And in my opinion that was the activating event. I mean that that what again was something that he had been fearful of, worried about, hyper vigilant about for months leading up to that. Well, the jury will return tomorrow morning to receive their instructions before they begin deliberating in this phase of the trial. Hammett is facing either life in prison with parole after 25 years, life in prison with parole after 34 years, life in prison without parole or the death penalty. Now, this is a case that we've been covering extensively for you and will continue to do so throughout tomorrow and when ultimately a decision is made. But for now, live in Warren, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News at 6.